This is Black Hills Fox Sports. Hello everybody, it was an exciting day on the local basketball scene as the Day of Hoops was held over at the Monument. Now the event is a fundraiser for a group of local high school players who are headed to a national tournament in Arizona. Let's check out a matchup this evening between the Lakota Ballers and Lakota All-Stars. The Ballers' Julius Duran gets to the hoop and lays it in. Duran plays his high school hoops over at Rapid City Christian. Lakota All-Stars up 70-50. to 50. Drew Bordeaux adds to the lead as he finds nothing but twine from it 199 nice looking touch on that shot Lakota ballers and get the ball to McKenzie Cass he connects on the uh, three pointer as both teams shooting it well from beyond the arc tonight the ballers cut the lead to 14 McKenzie Cass then gets the ball inside to Roger Other he hits for two inside these teams played a nice game Lakota All-Stars got the win 84 to 74 now the post 22 baseball team had its 20 game winning streak snapped today at a tournament in Colorado losing to lightning baseball it was a close one four to three. The hard ads did bounce back. They started a new winning streak defeating Pueblo Azteca 11 to one. Elsewhere in Legion baseball tonight, Belle Fouche rolled past Loveland, Colorado 13 to one. Sturgis fell the Billings upper deck eight to nothing. The state high school finals at rodeo wrapped up tonight in Fort Pier with the short go. Sturgis's Anna Haugen won barrel racing. She's also the overall state champ in barrel racing. Dupree's Minda Woodward took first in tonight's performance of breakaway roping. Ryan Elsher. Elsher's a familiar name to rodeo fans. He had the top saddle bronc ride of the short go tonight with a 69 point ride. Taryn Talsma took first in steer wrestling with a nice type uh, time of six. Point three seconds. Hey, there's reason to celebrate over at the Rapid City Central High School as Griffith Houchin has signed on the dotted line to compete in track and field at Park University in Arizona. The Gobblers Lolo Carlo is also signed to continue her basketball career at the North Dakota State College of Science in Wapaton. Carlo earned all state honorable mention honors this season. Now the North Dakota State College of Science is a two year school and Carlo is hopeful she'll have a chance to keep playing after her time is done there. I just want to get better as a player. I want to. I want to win at North Dakota. I want to. At the School of Science, I want to win. I mean, I want to try my best to work and have, you know, maybe a Division One school pick me up. You know, you never know. I mean, I'm gonna just put in the work and try to let it speak for itself or do for itself. I love the location. I have two brothers who live down in Arizona, and they were a big reason for me to come down there. I got to visit once before I was even thinking about college and then immediately that was something that caught my eye. But um, the coaching staff there is fantastic. I do. Um, I did look a lot into their programs, and I got to meet a lot of the people that are, I'm going to be working under, and just a whole lot of the boxes were ticked, so I'm super excited and really, really pumped. Well, let's jump on in for another edition of Big O! Fish and tonight Carter Mellum grabs the spotlight. Carter reeled in this 18 inch rainbow trout out of Sheridan Lake. Congratulations to you, Carter, and best of luck in the rest of your fishing endeavors. You too can be featured on Big Old Fish. Just send us your picture by using the submit photos link at codedtv.com. Make sure and give us the full name of the person who caught the fish, what kind of fish it is, how big it is, and where it was caught. Get those pictures in, and we will get you on. Big old fish. Certainly exciting. Nice looking uh, fish there, Humberto. And yep. what I mentioned, congrats to those uh, Rapid City Central tandem. Signing on to play in college. Going to be fun to watch that group at the next level. Yeah, so that's a, that's impressive. And talking about that big old fish, right? That's big old, that, that was one big old fish. But do you got any more big old scores for us, Vic? Do have some big old scores for you tonight. Uh, College World Series has started in Omaha. Kentucky beat North Carolina State in a close game today. 5-4. to four. Stanley Cup Finals were over on Coda Territory tonight. Not much of a game. The Oilers, uh, the Panthers won the first three games of that series. The Oilers bounced back in a big way tonight. They stay alive with an 8-1 to one win, forcing a game 5. Twins and A's got rained out tonight. Rockies lead the Pirates 11-4 to four in the eighth inning. All right, well, thank you, Vic. Don't